They formed a close and enduring friendship after each took on star marking turns in James Cameron's iconic romance Titanic, released back in 1997. And Katie Winslet, 41, has revealed that her bond with Leonardo DiCaprio, 42, remains strong two decades later, so much so that they often utter lines from their movie script to each other whenever they're in a playful mood. In an interview with Glamour magazine, the Oscar-winning actress revealed that she and the Hollywood heartthrob are very, very close, as she admitted, sometimes we do quote the odd Titanic line back and forth to each other. She said, you don't even want to know the last conversation we had, because it was so funny and made me laugh so much. We found ourselves saying to each other, can you imagine if the world really knew the stupid things we say? I'm not going to tell you what we actually talk about, but yeah, we're very, very close and sometimes we do quote the odd Titanic line back and forth to each other, because only we can, and we find it really funny. Her interview comes days after photographs emerged of the pair getting cozy beside a swimming pool in the south of France earlier this summer, reigniting speculation of a romance, a rumor which they have consistently shot down. Kate and Leo were in St. Tropez for Leo's annual foundation gala held at the Domaine Verded Belayo, where the pair auctioned off the chance to dine with them at the winner's place of choice in New York City. Also in her interview, Kate revealed that, had acting not worked out for her, she likely would have been stuck for options, as her pre-fame attempt at hairdressing proved to be quite the calamitous experience. She said of her lack of backup career plan, I should have had one because if it had all gone T.S. up, I would have been stuck. I had a fleeting idea about becoming a hairdresser, but I cut off a friend's earlobe trying to cut their hair. I saw him again not too long ago and I was like, I'm so sorry for your earlobe. He said, yeah, you can still see the marks, but I'm proud of that now, Kate. Kate and Leonardo rocketed to superstardom after playing star-crossed lovers Rose DeWitt Bucator and Jack Dawson in the 1997 classic Titanic, and have remained close ever since. In the film, Winslet's character leaves fiancé Cal Hockley, played by Billy Zane, after meeting scrappy, working-class artist Jack and falling for him, while aboard the doomed luxury liner. The flick bagged 11 of the 14 Oscars it was nominated for the year after its release, and has since grossed a whopping $2 billion worldwide, the second film in history to do so after Avatar, also directed by James Cameron. Not stopping there, the pair then went on to star side by side again in romantic drama Revolutionary Road in 2008, directed by Kate's then husband Sam Mendes. Kate bagged the Best Actress gong at the 2009 Golden Globes for the flick and her speech went down in history with fans as she openly thanked Leo for both his cooperation on screen, and strong friendship. Emotionally taking to the stage, she gushed, Leo, I'm so happy I can stand here and tell you how much I love you and how much I've loved you for 13 years, and your performance in this film is nothing short of spectacular. I love you with all my heart, I really do, to which the actor blew her kisses from the audience. Following her win, Leo sweetly returned the compliments by revealing at the awards after party, she is still as beautiful and radiant as she was the day I met her, she's the best. The pair have been very open with their friendship in the past, attending a number of high-profile events and awards together over the years.